guess where I am. I am inside the Tao Young Medical Vault at Palisade. It turns out you can still get there even if you don't take the quest to come here. You just needed to have the key card. And uh, I, I killed a bunch of, you know, Rena cops who insisted that I shouldn't be down in here. So there was a bunch of loot in here. Even though that lady said this place was cleaned out, no, there was still a bunch of shit in here. There was loot in there, and there. Most of these, uh, containers. They cleaned out the MacGuffin evidence, but they didn't take all of the other loot. And guess what's right there? I didn't pick this up yet. But there's a safe here. You hack this shit open. I looted that. There's a Praxis Kit and three Neuropazins. That's a 13,000 gold value. But, yeah, I can't exactly buy that shit. <laughs> so. Here's something I didn't look at before. Prototype Schematic? I don't know what that... I don't know if that does anything that give me a new craft? I could already make the nano blades. Unless he got more efficient. I don't know. So anyway, I found and broke into the Tao Young medical vault. So you can get both of those Praxis kits. Um, I believe you need to do the machine cult first, otherwise you won't be able to get in there, I don't think. And then you just come here afterwards because you already have the key or at least you should have you should have the key here's the emails that run the computer which don't matter really now uh i'm recording this so that you can see kind of where it is this is there under the parking lot outside the bank there is this giant shaft but you don't use the elevator and on each level, there's these vaults. So this particular level right here is the one that is Tao Young Medical. The others are not the correct vaults, and you can't get into those because it wants you to have key cards, which I don't think are even in the game. I actually opened up uh, two other vaults down there, but I can't get into them because I don't have the cards for those, but I had the Tao Young Medical vault, which is right there. So at this point, we can just turn around and head back out. I killed a couple of guards on the way in here, uh, in the parking lot. I wasn't going to bother trying to sneak my way past them. You need to have the jump augment in here. And probably the fall one, the, uh, the fall damage augment as well, so you can just jump down, not risk dying. Probably go out the same way I came in. So we are finally done with the bank. Now, in order to get in there, here in this area here, in the parking lot, there's a giant rotating fan over here. If you have the remote... Uh, actually, no, I don't think you can do that, because that's just a switch. This switch right here turns the fan on or off. But, uh, you have to be on that side to get to it, which is obviously no good. So what, you really, what, what you're basically going to do is just break the fan. I, shooting at it might work, or throwing a grenade, but I just tossed some shit in here. I threw this thing in there, and the fan broke. So that got it to turn off. You gotta break that fan so you can get through. And here's all the rent cops I killed with their, uh, their squirt guns. Oh, I did not rob this area. I don't know if there's any other way to turn that fan off. I wasn't going to really bother looking. That's the bathroom. The box that I used was in here, I believe. I think it was in, it was in here. I picked up a box from in there and just carried it over to the van. So as for the Harvester quest... We can't continue the next step of that yet. 
but uh, welcome to Palisade Property Bank. Mission resume combat. I don't know what that's about. Don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. But I believe, like the next time we come to uh, the city, that's when I'll get the next step of the quest. But you won't get it unless you completed the unless you properly completed this step. So what we need to do now. TF29. Yeah. The only other thing to do right now is to go talk to our boss. No, no, no. You can't defend against that kind of team. You need to complete that quest without Sorry. accusing uh, Radko or Johnny if you want to get the follow-up quest. But I can't pick it up yet. I have to pick it up when I come back to Prague the third time, I believe. Enough problems already. There's not too much left of this game, so I've gotten... At this point, I've gotten, like, all of the Praxis kits except the fourth one off the vendor and the one from the final boss, which that one really doesn't matter. Which that's the main thing I've been looking at. I think I've done all of the quests, although I failed some of them because of, a. Uh, I didn't really give a shit. It's like, oh, you didn't stealth into this area and not trigger an alarm. Well, tough shit. I did, I, I did all of the quests as far as I'm concerned, just didn't have the endings that everyone else wanted. <laughs> Let's put it that way. Anyway, here's the next bit of story. So you found the bomb maker, linked everything to us. Not exactly. Jesus, Jensen. It wasn't Ark. We did find the bomb maker. Her name was Allison Stanek. She was... Was? Wow, Jensen. You still do leave a lot of past Hey, she, this one killed herself. I didn't kill her. She was mixed up with the Church of the Machine God. She called herself their High Priestess. And before she ended her own life, she told me she'd made dozens more bombs, which she then delivered to Victor Marchenko. So it was a... A splinter faction inside her. I'm telling you, Miller, something more is going on here. Stanek told me Marchenko has a base of operations in the Swiss Alps, a research facility called Gar. That sound like something Ark has the resources for to you? I'll contact McCree. Get him and a few analysts to work up a plan. We need to move on this now. Chicane and I can fly there and back and get a lay of the land while Mac and his team do the research. Really? Got it all figured out in that clockwork head of theirs. What the hell? I'm in. You got enough fuel to get to Switzerland? To get us there, sure. Fine, do it. But this is recon only. Do not engage. Contact me. Do not engage. Yourself. You're kidding, right? Yes, sir. You've proven yourself so far on this one, Jensen. Don't screw it up. Have you seen how big my Come body on. count is? But hey, we're going to Switzerland. That's one of the German-speaking countries. Miller is not used to giving compliments, is he? He's getting static from the brass. Starting to riot in Gollum over that shit with Rucka. I'm sure he doesn't blame you. Much. Anymore. And what do you think? I think tracking that bomb maker was some fine work. The intel you got from us that's true. In Gollum City, we've the least of our problems. So what do you say we go find out how deep in it we are? You all set. Yep, I pretty much uh, got everything taken care of up until this point. Hey, when we get to the Alps, we could get into some action. Are you ready for that? What? Because I've been flying hack for the last few years. That's the thing about us naturals, Jensen. We never rust. <laughs> you also aren't super strong. Look, 
I've been doing this a long time. Been in my share of shit, too. I always managed to pull myself out of it. Fair enough. Just don't leave without me. Hey, listen. I know we're not exactly pals, and I know I can be an asshole. But I'm not a fucking asshole. In fact, I'm offended you even say so. That's not what I meant. I'm just messing with you, Jesse. <laughs> Ready? Let's go, token black guy. When we first talked, you told me that your limp kept you honest. That's an interesting way of looking at an injury. Your preamble's as thin as soup, man. Don't dance around it, just ask it. I'm only curious. We've all got a story. No, that's not it. What you really want to know is, do I hate him? Men that tore out my knee. Shut. His name was Lachlan Lutz. He's a laborer. Worked in the mines up near Bendigo before. Oh, I, I just assumed you were home. shot or something. Beats was a family man who did what he thought he had to do in order to provide for his family. See, back then, nobody could compete with you, Oggs, when it came to manual labor jobs. So, he made a choice, if you can call it that. And his choice changed your life. You don't resent Beats for what happened? No, I resent it. The men who coaxed men like him to get augmentations, men who enforced a system where the rich could buy artificial expertise without thinking about what it would cost all of us in the end. No, I don't resent him. He's not anymore. I was simply in the wrong place at the wrong time. Story of my life. So look, on that sunshiny night, what do you say we put some miles behind us? Alright, we're going to hit the go. I don't really have anything else to do. Yeah, we're, that's all taken care of. Yeah, fire it up. No sound there. Oh, there it is. The sound was late. You know, if you want machinery to do your work for you, why don't you just get robots? Instead of making your workers get augments? Why don't you just build robots? And the uh, the sound is gone. It's literally gone. It's not my fault. I don't know why the sound is missing on this cutscene. It's just gone. I noticed it was gone right when it took off. And then it came back for a few seconds and it went off again. Well, I get, you know, overheating is probably not a problem here. Oh, okay, it's coming back. Okay. Oh no, I'm getting flashbacks to the snowy golden eye level. Running around lost in the goddamn snow on my N64. And there's another one from Perfect Dark. Another one from Mission Impossible. Ah, they're all just they're all collapsing in on me. This is a new door, since it's on the plot. What the hell? Oh look, the volume's gone again. Brother, you must really avoid taking those wrong turns, punch. I don't know what the hell just happened. A little taste, so at the end you'll understand what you're interfering with. Give my regards to Tuffles. I thought there'd be more blood. You said Rutger was covered in it. Rutger had more meat in him than this one. Maybe that's the difference. Yeah, yeah, 
that's not working. I'm afraid I'm going to have to concede. Voice actor, I am not. Maybe I should just restart my game now. The volume is just permanently fucked on the cutscenes. I don't know what's going on with it. Yeah, the, like the sound's just gone. <laughs> You'll carry him now. Yeah, I'm afraid I'm gonna have to concede. Um, I'm just gonna see if I can reboot the game and get this back on. Uh, and you. Alright, they, they could just be fucked, like, for this section of the game. I have no idea. And apparently it is sinking. 10 percent 30 you want to go faster game what's taking you so long to goddamn sink you're not downloading something are you yeah i'm waiting for it to finish its sync so i can like re-upload it it's at 80 now There it goes. Usually that takes like one second. Alright, it's going to be coming back up in a second here. Alright, let's see what the last checkpoint is on. It might be before we took off. Well, here's when I'm in the snow before we get caught, so we'll go with that one. If it's not back now, there's not much I can do about it. So this is before I uh, walk, walked up to the door. We've gotta hack the scrub door again. It's right when you hit the door. I'm not gonna bother planting a save because if it doesn't work this time, we're just gonna keep going. Here we go. Hey, sound. You really must avoid taking those wrong turns. A little taste. So at the end you understand what you're interfering with. Oh. You I'm not paying for that. Tell. I thought there'd be more blood. You said Rocker was covered in it. Rocker had more meat in him than this one. Maybe that's the difference. Where the hell do all these secret organizations come from? Your kid has no mercy. How do you record? His own will come. For that. It will be slow. And it will be painful. Just time enough for a man to think on his sins. Where do you put your job applications for the Illuminati? It means the facility is compromised. We should move out. No. We were warned that this one was coming. We have time before they start searching for me. You are certain. What about your friends from Ark? Those fools have outlived their usefulness. Let them drink a little more. Then 
Don't go bodies with this one. Enough of this dead weight. You carry him now. This is as far as I go. You're flying back to Brock. I need to meet with those devoured beasts. Need them to accelerate the timeline so our ship will clear its costumes immediately. They will want more money. Smugglers always want more money. But the valley won't get it. So the men and I should stay here and proceed as planned? Brown confirmed everything with Vikos last night. Date and time. How the hell do they sneak up behind me in the snow like that? End of the line for you, friends. No, it's a uh, cutscene bullshit. The plot says you get captured here. You don't even get a chance to fight. If you really want us to get captured like that, why not just put a landmine on the door? She can't. She can't. Come in. Oh, shit, is that neon? Choice, huh? I don't think it really matters. Alice, it's me. I need help. Finally! Been trying to raise you ever since you blew off the bank. Where the hell are you? The Swiss Alps. A research facility called Garm. Walked into an ambush. I can't raise TF 29's pilot. The Swiss Alps? Fuck, man. It's gonna take time to scrounge up a veto. What happened? They were waiting for me when I got here. Marchenko and the gold mask mercs from Dubai. You gotta get out of there. Look, stay low, find an exit, and... Well, I'll get back to you when I've got a plan. I'll keep trying to raise my pilot. These guys think I'm dead, Alex. Maybe I can take advantage of that. Have to peek around. Why would they think you're dead? They, they know what they shot into me. They know how long it would take to kill me. Unless they just have really good Wolverine augments. They didn't expect that. It was nice enough for them to leave me with all my guns. I'm trying to find something I can throw into that van over there. I don't work. Here's how I broke into this, the, uh, the vaults earlier. Get in there. Probably guess that big, big buff over there is the final boss. He'll drop a Praxis kit, but at that point, like, it's right before the game is over with anyway. should have put a bunch of bullet in my heads like I'm gonna do to you. See, I make sure people are dead when, when it's important. How do you recruit for a place like this? It's like, what, do you go to indeed.com? Or a career builder, and it's like, so you want to join the Illuminati and be in a secret organization? <laughs> Send in your resume. I just don't know how they fucking recruit. No idea what this does, but I've got batteries. Idea. Moving the crane. Yeah, I can see that. Why? Because it let me do it. To show you how much your security sucks. To show you how much your security sucks. Is that right? 
Well, stay right there for a minute and you can show me that in person. <laughs> That's a funny answer. Okay. It's actually coming. pipe up there that's moving back and forth. Right. Just trying to figure out what this shit does first. It's Mission Impossible lasers up there. That is quite a ways up. Stop baby jumping and get on it. Sometimes they'll do a little sissy jump when you need him to do a regular sized one. It's like, I need to go higher. Taking them off. Listen, there's a helipad north end of the facility. I'm on my way. Alex, I don't need that ride. I found my pilot. That's a relief. Let me know when you're back in Prague. Copy that. I'm guessing it doesn't matter at all who you call. Might want to start looking for the cure for whatever it is they shot us up with. I'm not going to bother hacking that. Should have killed me when you had the chance, guys. Here. 
That's a good shot. Proud of that one. All right, I think that takes care of business. Now, really, why would I go through the trouble of stealth and pass all those guys? It's like I don't do stealth. up my inventory again. This is the shitty gun. <laughs> Demon body. <sighs> I remember when I played Hitman Absolution a, uh, a while back. Which is supposed to be a stealth game, but the stealth is so fucking bad. It is just retarded. It doesn't work at all. I just shot my way through the game pretty much like this. But it wasn't even fun to do that. The, ga the game itself was shitty. I had a negative review posted for a while but I wiped all of those now I generally only post reviews for games that I've recorded just to link to the videos it's a shitty system and uh gotten tired of being the only one using it properly. Kind of tempted to go in here. Attention all personnel. The clubhouse is closed. Oh, it doesn't go anywhere. It's full of paid chills. People praising the hell out of the game, even though they only put in an hour or two. You'll see positive reviews from people who only barely played the game and like never touch it again. And then you'll see negative reviews from people who put in like a hundred hours. I'm like, why the fuck would you play it for so many hours if you don't like it? Do you also like whipping yourself on the back like a flagulent? Is that a hobby of yours? I hate this game, it's terrible, but I'm going to play it for 150 hours. But when I was posting legitimate reviews that were well-typed, like, professional quality, they just got hit with downvotes all the time. There was, like, almost no respect for doing it. It's just like, oh, he's negatively panning this game. I'm just gonna downvote. It's mainly an issue when you're posting negatives. Oh, hi, camera. You're a bit late on that. The shooting range has expired. It has uh, run out of targets. But I've also decided to stop spending so many, so much time on games I don't like. It's like uh, I have a new lead nowadays, and it's uh, promote the positive, ignore, ignore the fucking negative. Stop wasting your time on it. If 
I was still doing normal reviews, I'd probably just do positive ones on games that I liked and just not review the games I don't like. I don't know what's in here, but... like this was a waste, but I'm not hurting for money. I haven't broken one of these in a while. I wonder if that does something useful. I don't see anything up here. That did climb in this bitch. I don't know if I want to do that yet. It goes into that room there. So I guess you can just open this door. Security level one. Man, this is a huge area. Why aren't the cops raiding this place? Do something useful. So like, here's your bad guys. We found the evil base. Villain Corp. It's like, oh, what? You need evidence? You don't need evidence to gun down people in the street. Trying to figure out what that thing up there is for. There wouldn't be a point to moving it if you couldn't get on top of it. There's stairs over there. I don't know if I've successfully looted everyone or not. This is such a massive area. Combat rifle. They're carrying the good gun. Some of them anyway. What is this shit? Shadow opera. Gun down there. Not even gonna bother jumping off to get it. All cargo not loaded by O400 will be terminated in the Guessing that doesn't go anywhere. Well now that thing up there I can move around. But I don't know how to actually get on it. So it's like there's no obvious way to get on that thing. Attention all personnel. The clubhouse is closed. We are clearing the site. Transports are en route. We have been discovered. We are gunning out of here. Protagonist has arrived. He's killing everyone. Evacuate immediately. I'm trying to figure out the point of this. Looks like there's three pipes that it can connect to. But I can't get on top of the thing, so what does it even matter? I've tried to get up there. That seems to be like the only way. I guess if I stack enough goddamn boxes, I'll 
get up there. Oh, oh, god. Damn it. This is not gonna fucking work. God damn physics. Oh my god, I jumped off. Might finally have a way to get on this thing. Figured it out. Nothing up here. these even go anywhere. I wonder if the only purpose of moving this is to use it to get somewhere else in this room. three pipes on the right side and it can connect to either of any of those. I have no idea what the is. Seems like a whole lot of development work for nothing. There's a ground in front of that. I could probably just jump on that. You don't go into these. It's nice to see a room like this, though, with so much stuff to climb around on. This is what you call a sandbox. Let me pick this up. It glows. All right, I guess we'll continue on. We're We've got so many goddamn pistol bullets. Not as many sniper rounds. I guess I should have just used the damn door. let him get further up here.
probably would have been better off to take the door. Is there another one? Maybe I'm just not good at counting anymore. I thought there was a fourth one. to drop something, you're carrying too much. I've got plenty of ammo, though. Uh, do I have magnum bullets? I'm tempted to shoot some of their guns for a while. I literally don't have room for that shotgun. You know, I could start drinking bows. I can get trashed. Even if it is just gonna bleed back off. Is there any more of it? I still don't have enough of that. Oh, so the grenades stack up to 10, huh? I'm trying to pick up the shotgun, because that's the more valuable thing. Dismantle a grenade. Still can't hold that shotgun. Yeah, I'm trying to fit it in there. Hey, look, I got it. <laughs> Hit bed. And we are fucked up. Oh man, could you imagine playing the whole game like this? Should call it game order vision. Perimeter detail reports east side all clear. Alright, maybe it's time to fool around with these landmines. Oh, that's nano blade. I thought that was a mine template. So I don't actually have the mine templates. <laughs> I have so much shit. I don't know what to do with it all. Let me introduce myself. Experimental hugs. That gun's out of ammunition. We 
have an auto alert. There's so much fucking smoke. I wonder if they threw a smoke grenade. All right, give me back this gun, put that one there, and this one there. Look at that, Titan. Put up goddamn Titan armor. Might not be able to kill him through that. Still got it active. Get my armor piercing rounds. Down. He was tougher than a goddamn tank. Another tight. Thing the cops aren't hugged mid like these guys. Or we'd have fucking problems. It's like, yeah, you could stealth, but I mean, it's not like you're gonna run out of ammunition. They're donating plenty. Hostile on site will do. Oh no, I can't get the combat rifle ammo. That is no good. You're not gonna tell me I can't pick up a goddamn combat rifle. Drop this. Drop it. Give me my guns back. to take some drugs. right with you guys. I got bodies to loot. Sniper rifle ammo. Sniper rifle. Even got a shooting range. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that everything about this place is fucking illegal. Everything. The fact that it even exists. Do the cops care? Nope. Don't care at all. They're too busy hassling everyone in the damn street. You can't walk up and down the street without being pestered ten times for, uh, 
papers, but oh no, you can have a secret facility full of super soldiers and guns. Yeah, that scope doesn't do anything. That's a battle rifle. They're fine with you having this. I mean, how the hell would you keep a place like this secret? To, to fund a place like this. To operate it, to manage it, to staff it. I'm not even gonna bother picking up that scope. We're not gonna have the space to carry that thing around. It's like, there's no way you could hide a place like this. What's the point of this? What does it do? Cargo two is loaded and awaiting secure. Slavensky, report to cargo four for inspection. He's probably dead. There's a good chance of it. Of workout areas. guns in this game like there's no there's no Gatlin gun there's no laser gun there's no plasma gun I mean they existed in the last game so you can't say they don't exist now this would be the perfect place to find one of those I mean they've got augmented super soldiers they would probably have super weapons Oh, shit, that's a sentry gun. Yeah, maybe I should have just left that alone. That was not a camera. I can't even bother to hack stuff in here right now. It's like, no, we're on a killing spree. Well, this is level one. Let's go. I'm not waiting for it. We're getting our asses handed to us. If you're still alive, evacuate immediately. The protagonist has a rock. You know, I, I keep finding grenade packs, but I have yet to ever find a grenade launcher. Why would you put grenade packs in a game that doesn't have a grenade launcher? It hasn't been anywhere. I haven't seen it on a single vendor anywhere in the game. I haven't found one. Can't craft it. As far as I know, there is no grenade launcher. But there's ammo for it, right? So... Therefore, it must exist. <laughs> Not even taking that up. Man, this place is a gold mine. My inventory size would be 
could be twice as big and I wouldn't be able to pick up everything. Oh shit, that's the sentry tar. I'm tempted to just blow that thing up. It's a large waste of ammo though. Bullets we don't need to be wasting. Alright, let's find out how to get out of here. section. If you've been carrying around tons of medical items, this is as good a place as any to start down on a mob. Of course, now I can't see. There's a guy there. Alright, my vision's coming back. Oh, he's got the damn tight. You're not invulnerable, it just takes more bullets. Fast reload on that pistol. I think I've got the perk upgraded though. That's arc. Attention, intruder alert. I did not kill these guys. You know, I'm starting to think that uh, Jensen is immune to neon. Oh, wait a minute, I figured it out. It's, uh, Neon is lethal to anyone who has Neuropazin in, in, in their bodies. So he would be immune to it, because he doesn't take Neuropazin. That's why they assumed he was just going to die and he chunks his body out. So if you don't take Neuropazin, they don't know, they would not know that Jensen doesn't take Neuropazin. They just assume, yeah, he's a super soldier. Probably puts it in his drinking water. Yeah, I made a stunning revelation. I've only been barely paying attention to the story in this game. Most of the damn game, though, was about a train station bombing. It's like, why is that so important? All personnel on floor level. Shoot hostile on sight. I probably killed ten times more people than the train station bombing did over the course of the game to solve the, to solve the investigation for it. I don't know who you're alerting at this point. Everyone remain on alert. This is not a drill. Sir, everyone's dead. It's like, oh, okay. I guess I'll stop broadcasting. That's a breach software. So I'll have to go tell or sell it to the tech guy. Well, we're gonna have a field day at the vendor. I'm tempted to pull out their gun. But you see, their guns don't have any upgrades. Or 
I could upgrade one, but I don't like any of the other guns. I like I like my gun, I like the ones I'm using. Let's get some batteries. I still haven't used Typhoon like a single time throughout the game. Anyway, there's probably more story stuff coming up, so I'm going to uh, give it a rest here. I will pick this up in the next one.